What should we choose? This one? Hmm. No, maybe this one. No, we can do better. This one? Yeah, that's the one. Guys, you need to know about this server tracker tool in DaVinci Resolve. If you want to learn how to use it, then stick around to the end of this super easy tutorial. While you're here, if you could just take two seconds to hit that subscribe button, I'd really appreciate it. Also, if you need a video editor, drop me a message on my socials, links in the description below. Okay, so let's kick this off by saying that this feature is only available in the studio version of DaVinci Resolve, but that's another reason why I think you should get the studio version of DaVinci Resolve. So we're gonna start by putting our video clip on the timeline. Then put your playhead over the video clip. Go to the color page and then to effects. Now in effects, search for the service tracker and drag this into your node window as a second node. Now you need to connect green to green and then on the right, select bounds. Then you can drag a rectangle roughly where you want your logo to appear. Next, go to mesh and add a few more points if you need to. I'm just gonna add a couple more. Go to track and select better instead of faster. Click on track to end and let the resolve do its thing. Now you need to add your logo. So go to the media pool and drag your image onto the node window. On the PNG node, connect the green square to the second green arrow on the surface tracker node. And then connect the top blue output on the PNG to the bottom blue input on the surface tracker node. If you wanna play with the results, go to the results tab here on the right, then select go to reference. Now you can resize your logo by moving the white box around the logo. You can also change the composite type down here. This one, for example, soft light, makes the logo look more like a print on a t-shirt. So there you go. This is a really cool feature that you can use on your videos. Link them down below in the comments so I can see how you use it. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and I'll see you in the next one.